Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Tribunal. We last left off. We were a little we were umming and ahhing a little bit about what to do with this guy, how to beat him. He obviously has the final piece of what it is that we're looking for. The king wants us to kill him for no other reason than to prove um our valiant worth. Yes. <laughs> I feel sorry for this guy. The king took him in. Right. Okay. I think we're going to be we're as, as ready as we uh, are going to be. So fight your champion. All right. No problem. But we have to vampiric ring him quickly. Right. Okay, so we got two two lots of vampiric ring in there, and these dwarven darts did the business last time. Right, but we've got to do it now. Where is he? Where is he? We've got to start damaging him now. There he is. Yeah, that's really doing the business, actually. These dw dwarven darts are absolutely... Hold! I am beaten! You are a... You are a great warrior, Hexem. You should speak with my liege. That is what you get. Hang on. You're carrying one of my... That's mine. Out of interest, can we kill you? <laughs> Send for it. Whatever. Resist arrest. Oh, whatever. Resist arrest. Let's have a look what he's got. Oh, he's only got a few. Okay. I just was like, I was just curious to see what would happen. I, d I actually did expect them to be dangerous and uh, come and attack, particularly as he gave in. It's not very honourable to behave in that way. Right, Mr. King. Enough. I have seen you fight my champion, though I find it hard to imagine how you have succeeded. I did not believe anyone could best Carrad, but you have shown me otherwise. And he speaks. There are depths to you, Hexem. That I will fathom in time. For now, you have proven yourself. Yes. I am impressed, XM. None have defeated Carrad in battle. And I certainly didn't expect you to be the first. I conti you continue to surprise me. You have proven your worth to me. As, as well as your loyalty. Take this as a token of my faith in your friendship. It is my father's ceremonial dagger. And it has... And... and uh, and I place it in your possession. Do not disgrace his memory, Hexem. Now go. I have plans for you. Carrod. The maze you were able to defeat him. Plans. As I am certain you know, Mornhold is one of the seats of power for the tribunal. The goddess Almalexia resides in her temple surrounded by the high ordinators. I have no great love for Almalexia, her ordinators, or the tribunal, of which she is part. In light of recent events, I believe she... Uh, it is time to gather more information about them. The attack on Monhold was an unex was one as uh, unexpected to me as it was destructive to the city, and I make it my business to remain forewarned of this sort of event. Many believe the attacking creatures to have been Dwemer constructs, but we know that this is not the case. Uh, we know that too. These Dwemer creatures were beyond anything dreamt of by the dwarves. Creatures it would take the power of a god to create. I would like you to learn more about the attacks. I believe that the only person who might have shed light on the situation is Almalexia herself. All indications are that these creatures must be the constructs of Sotha Sil, and only Almalexia is likely to have information about him. I wish for you to speak with her and learn what she knows about the creatures and report to me. There is no reason for the goddess to suspect that you and I may be allied. Use this to your advantage. Do not speak to me again until you have learned what you can. Welcome, Zara. Right. And what about you, hmm? 
What may Carrard do for you, mighty one? Right, Mr. Carrard. Pieces of the blade. When I was a child, my father gave me this weapon. He told me that as long as I had it, none would defeat me in battle, until the rightful omen came to claim it from me. I know that you are the one whom he spoke. I give you, I give it to you freely. May it serve you as uh, uh, well as it has served me. Brilliant. You can still hold them Dwemer darts in your hand, my friend. <laughs> Looks like you are. Let's have a look at this blade then that he's given us. It's an odd twin blade. It's a long blade, a one-handed blade. Looks pretty cool, my friend. Uh, that's all you have to say to me. So, I think, guys, what we need to do is pop back and see that orc. Toodaloo, chaps. Do you remember that orc in God's Reach? Do you? You should do. <laughs> if you don't remember him, you've got a very bad memory. Temple Courtyard. Where does this take us? To the plaza. Uh, plaza. Doesn't really make a difference, I suppose. Uh, which way is which? Great Bazaar, God's Reach. God's Reach is where we want to go. It is, you know. Hmm. Yes. Right. Let's go see that orc. Yeah, because we've got the, all the three pieces. Hooray for that. Museum, we stole. Not really stole, just sort of took back what was rightfully ours. Like Robin Hood. <laughs> Forge the blade, you! Right, you've got some interesting pieces there. I can work with this. Make the best blade you've ever seen. Not that I figure you'd know a die katana from a butter knife. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Come back in two days' time, and I'll have your blade. Now leave me alone. Me, custom armor. I'm the one you want. Yeah. He doesn't really like us very much, but I wouldn't mind paying for him to do the work. He doesn't have to do it for free. I'll pay you. How much does it cost normally? I'll pay that. Hmm? Don't treat me with such disrespect just because you're offering to do it for free. That's your problem. Hmm? It is. It's your problem. Anyway, I suppose we should go and speak with Almalexia. Oh, it's all getting a bit confusing at the moment, isn't it? There's like multiple quests going on at the same time. Is this how Tribunal works? I don't know. I haven't had much to do with the King so far. Hello, Almalexia! Were you to you were to forge the blade of the Nerevan once again? Yeah, well, I'm like on with that at the moment, but I have to come back in two days' time. The best weaponsmith of all time, real, reside in my city, right? Okay, brilliant. What about this thing? Is it good that you brought it to its possession? Surely it would be a boon to all my people. Lovely. I kind of don't trust you. Yeah, what about Solar Sil? Do not concern yourself with Solar Sil. He lives in his own way. As uh, he always has. No, I have spoken with him in a lot. I have not spoken with him in a long time. But this is not odd. I'm certainly, all, I'm certain all is well with my old friend. Right. Uh, pieces of the blade. We've talked about that. Let's time up. We can't actually affect her disposition to us, I just noticed. She doesn't have any disposition towards us. Beliefs? Royal Guard? Seville? I don't know who that is. Oh yes, that's the man who was dead. Twin. Well, Helseth, what about him? Helseth is the king of Morrowind. He is young and has much to learn. Soon I will learn. he will learn the strength of the Tribunal Temple and it's important to all my people. 
the hands, yes. Barenzia, yes, the mother to the young king. A fascinating woman. Mortal, but fascinating. What about ash storms? Okay, he doesn't really have much to say about that either. Salas Valor, perhaps? Salas was once the most trusted hand and a faithful servant, but his recent behaviour has been erratic. No problem. Don't really seem to have much to say, really, do you? Missing hand? Yeah, no. Okay, that, we didn't get a journal update for that. No, not really. Yeah, right, well, Almalexia, thanks a lot. <laughs> She's not very helpful, is she? Not really. Right, when we come back, guys, um, we might take care of a little bit of tidying up, I think. There's a little bit of tidying up that we need to do, so we'll probably just have a little look at doing that. Um, look at these guys. I wouldn't mind... Well, I wouldn't want to take any of these on. I mean, if particularly if Salas Valor was uh, indicative of how powerful they are. And this is a whole host of them. Five of them would be impossible. In the light of my mercy. Hmm. Yes. Right. Anyway, that'll be enough for one day. So until then, until next time, stay safe. Take care of yourself. Goodbye.